y'all. It's Tiffany, HCG, HCG Housewife. I couldn't think of my name all of a sudden. Um, I did a video yesterday, and my husband walked in, and I, he knows I, he knows I vlog, especially on HCG and and with some craft stuff. But I, I just don't like filming in front of him, especially when he first walks in, because you know you gotta say hi, how was your day and stuff. But anyway, um, so I'm reporting for. It's VLCD 4, no, 5, but I'm reporting for VLCD 3 and 4. And I really don't even remember what VLCD 3 was now. I don't, I mean, I pretty much followed my, I'm going to just say I'm doing my own protocol because I am going over in um, protein and, um, you know, yesterday I had like a point... I want to say it was like a point four, no point, no, yeah, I remember now. Point six six release. My scale is very on point there. I mean, you you know pretty much by the ounce. And let's see. Then yesterday, VLCD four went to the fair with my residents. As you know, as some of you know, I work with people who have Alzheimer's, and um, so I get to go you know i go on the outings and stuff with them when they get to go and we went to the state fair of texas and we went my husband and i went last week before um sorry my arm's getting tired before um i started the hcg diet and so you know i i ate whatever i wanted to and this time i had all intentions of ah, that always tells you i didn't do good all intentions of doing good but um you know, when someone hands you a corny dog, sometimes you just got to eat it. And I'm not going to make an excuse. I'm just going to, I'm going to say the facts. I, I made a conscious decision to eat the corn dog. I, um, took that opportunity to take my medicine because it was, um, time to do that anyway. And I always have to take that with food. But I'd brought, the thing is, is I brought Melba toast to do that. And you really can't bring food and drinks in, but they didn't check my bag, so I did have a little pa a little a little package of Melba toast, and then I had a bottle of water. So I didn't drink the the Coke that was passed out as well. But you know, you know, I'm not gonna, like I said, I'm not gonna make excuses. But outings are hard, and I don't we don't go on as many as we did whenever I worked um, in this kind of job before, because I was the one responsible for planning and taking the people. Now I just kind of ride along. And I don't get to plan that, but we're talking about changing that, especially now that the weather's cooler, and and get my 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 little Alzheimer's, my little forgetful friends, um, out more because you know they enjoy it. They get tired easy, but they enjoy it. But anyway, the point is, is oh sorry about that. The outings are are tough because some, especially at the fair, you know you're there <clears throat> pretty much all day, and you want and you get hungry. And some of the places you can't take food in. Um, but most of our outings will be going to restaurants, you know, maybe to the mall to walk around and stuff like that. So it shouldn't be a problem. Um, but anyway, I didn't gain anything. And, you know, I'd, the thing is, is with, okay, I had the corn dog. And then I was hungry. So I still had, you know, when I got back to the community, I had my lunch. And, um... I stayed under what my fitness pal says I need to lose weight, but I didn't stay under the HCG. But here's my question. When something like that happens, do you still take your HCG? I'm doing homeopathic, and they might not even be good. Maybe they're expired. I don't know. But I didn't take either the drops or the pellets, and um, I don't know. Should I have went ahead and did that or was not taking them okay? Um, throughout the day, the only other things I had was I had apple and I had some cabbage and um, chicken later for dinner. And, well, it is what it is. I didn't gain. Usually it takes me a day to catch up, so I might have a gain tomorrow. But since I'm back on track today, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll have another, you know, I'll have a goose egg. Because that's what I had. I had a goose egg today. Um, I think I've lost like a little over five pounds so far, and I'm okay with that considering the, the cheat yesterday and having a little more protein. Um, 
but I'm back where I started. I've lost my load weight, and that's about it. But anyway, other than that, um, today should be back on track. I'm going to have um, P2, P2 orange chicken. I'm sure everybody's had that recipe. And cabbage today for lunch. And I'm going to have, um, I think, tilapia for dinner. And that's usually very low-cal when I have that tilapia in salad dinner. And we'll see what tomorrow brings. Have a good day. Bye-bye.